back to my channel. Today we're making upgrades. As you can see, I have a microphone, so comment below if you, the sound quality is much better. Today we're gonna make grilled turkey and cheese melts. Here's the ingredients you're gonna need. You're gonna need some Can't Believe It's Not Butter Spray or the Walmart equivalent. You're gonna use some 45 calorie bread. You can buy this at Aldi. You're gonna need some Oscar Mayer honey smoked turkey breast. Uh, deli sliced and you're going to use some Velveeta sharp cheddar cheese. And this is the lowest calorie I could find. Now if you live in a different state comment below if you still have fat free cheese. I'm trying to find fat free cheese but in Oklahoma it's sold out everywhere. So comment below if you know a place where you can get some. So what we got is three big slices of bread and we're going to do 3.4 ounces, which ends up being three slices each on each sandwich here. And then we're going to add the, the cheese on top. the sandwiches. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to spray, spray the grill with some non-stick. Then we're going to go to the sandwiches here and we're going to spray it with the, the butter and spray it real good because we're kind of creating the grilled cheese sandwich effect which always has butter on both sides. So we're going to put the butter side down on each of these. And then we're going to spray the top with the butter. And then we're going to cook for five minutes. Five minutes has passed, we're going to check on them, and that is perfect right there. So we're just going to put them on here like this. See it's got the grill marks and everything just like grilled cheese. It's just going to have some protein in it to make it anabolic. So we're just going to move it over here. Here's how many calories are in the grilled turkey and cheese melts. Now if you eat all three, which most people are not going to be able to, but I'm just doing what I do at lunch because I eat a lot of sandwiches. So all three is 475 calories, 65 carbs, 11 grams of fat, 42 grams of protein, 12 grams of sugar, and 15 grams of fiber. And like I've always said, the fiber is going to keep you satisfied and keep you full. If you're watching this video, please like and subscribe to this channel and hit the bell button to get notifications when I make a new video. Thank you for watching my video. This is Scott Saka reminding you to never stop improving yourself in everything you do.